Welcome everyone. This is Scott Unklebach, Director of Field Leadership for ID Life. It's my privilege to be with you tonight with our formulator, our chief formulator, Paul Sullivan. Paul is a guy that I've known for a number of years now. He's tremendously respected in the industry. Uh, as you can see in his bio that he's a pharmacist and a compound pharmacist and a formulator and a licensed nutritionist. He's been responsible for creating over 400 products. And if I was to tell you about some of those, you would recognize the names of those products. He understands the wellness industry, but he has a passion for nutrition and he has a passion for ID nutrition. Matter of fact, he's made it a focus of the last 17 years. And so People think that if they eat three squares a day and a sufficient amount of protein and carbohydrates and fats that they're getting all they need, but basically the way kind of our lifestyles have gone today, or the way we're working, uh, mothers and, and wives often uh, working and needing to prepare food in a quick way or pick up prepared food from a grocery store or God forbid uh, maybe get fast food, you know, we're just finding that the, there's less of the good nutrition and more of the bad nutrition. So in a in a more uh, kind of crude way, say there's too little of the good stuff and too much of the bad stuff. And you hear terms like you know the processed foods and Franken food is one I like to use, where there's so many ingredients in in the food now, particularly if you're buying it outside the house, that are affected by all the sides. You know, there's four of the sides I talk about insecticides insecticides and pesticides and herbicides and fungicides. Your meats have more estrogens, antibiotics. Uh, the trans fats, the high sugar, the high fructose, corn syrup, food coloring, plasticizers. I mean, where's the food? You know, where's the nutrition that we had, you know, 20, 30, even 40 years ago? And government uh, statistics will show that some of these major minerals like magnesium is down over 50 percent uh, in our foods, uh, potassium down 80 percent, where the only mineral that's really increasing is salt. And, it's, and it also is not only the food we're getting, and even if we can buy organic and buy fresh and buy close to home, it's often the way we cook it. And if, if it's a slow cooker, it's okay, but today using microwaves, uh, we're losing at a, over 106 degrees, we're losing all the enzymes in food and many of the nutrients. So, and I know how many mothers and, and fathers and uh, people out there today have to use the micro to warm up food they prepare, they picked up outside or maybe leftovers. And to find out that that's nothing but bulk, nothing but fiber, nothing but uh, maybe some carbs that can uh, generate a little bit of uh, energy because it'll convert to sugar, the nutrition is just empty. So it's all about the quality of the food we select, the lifestyle, and then the way this impacts our long-term health is things that are happening today. The prescriptions you're taking today at 40, 50 years of age, maybe just one blood pressure med, maybe something for cholesterol. That problem started, you know, 15 years ago. It didn't start yesterday or last week when your doctor told you you had to start on Lipitor. So these are long-term risks, you know, long-term considerations. So we just got to make sure that we're getting our nutrition. And I basically start off with my vitamins and, and the rest of anything I get with a carefully balanced meal, timing it right, uh, trying to get, uh, uh, say, less of the bad, more of the good. I still know that if I'm taking my supplements, that I'm getting the nutrition I need and that my cells need. And so I thought if I could come up with a system to alert the doctors or alert the patients or the clients what those risk factors were that they could do both. And, and what I want to position this is, is that I'm not uh, an alternative healthcare professional. And as you showed in, in my bio, I have a lot of healthcare background, a lot of uh, very rigorous scientific and in, in, in biological training and pharmaceutical training. But my practice, my outlook, my philosophy is integrative meaning we're working with medicine, not against it. It's not alternative. It's not take my vitamins, don't take your prescriptions. It's not get acupuncture, don't have surgery. It's, it's not conflict as I see it. I think it should be uh, working hand in hand 
hand in glove uh, to be integrative, one working with the other. So the last few years I've worked hard to kind of evolve the, the drug nutrient interaction problem to uh, into an easy software assessment that analyzes things like diet and lifestyle and, and, and medical conditions and things like that in addition to uh, over-the-counter drug use too, not just prescription use. You know, if you're using uh, 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 aspirin, if you're using uh, uh, ibuprofen, uh, acetaminophen, things that are you'd find in over-the-counter type medications or in combinations, you you know you 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 have risks of interactions with with nutrients or depleting certain nutrients, and that's the evolving science that we are uh, have taken a leadership position in is ascertaining which drugs, which OTC new, uh, ingredients deplete critical nutrients. And by doing that, replacing those nutrients bef before they become a problem, before either ha you have health erosion or potentially um, more medical conditions that require more prescriptions, which is kind of the way the game is played. We call it the prescription cascade. Yeah, we have looked at over 7,000 studies, probably implemented about 4,000 of them, Scott, that are, that are uh, developed into algorithms within the system and adding more every day because this is a dynamic situation. Science is changing, our clients are changing, our patients are changing, our, our membership is changing on a day-to-day -day basis. They, they uh, have different medical challenges, they're taking different prescriptions, they're hopefully changing their exercise, they might be changing their nutrient need. So we're saying that the, we, we've done these, looked at all these medical studies in order to base the recommendations on scientific evidence only. But all of these studies kind of give us uh, updates and, and we look at things on a monthly basis. We go back and look at 5,200 journals to review these studies and see if there are any new or corrective studies in addition to um, uh, say new uses for our current ingredients. But in all cases, can we if we find a pharmaceutical interaction, we can correct that, add that block in in the software in an hour. What is pharmaceutical grade nutrition, and why does that separate us from most other companies? Not 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 all companies, but most companies. Scott, the FDA requires, and you can buy just about anything. Um, on the shelf and, and know that it's pretty standard I and mean, if you go into a Walnut, Walmart or a, a, a CVS or a, a big box retailer that if you buy their supplements that if they say they have um, you know 500 milligrams of vitamin C it'll be in there but the problem is you really have to rely on the uh, manufacturer the brand that they have which was not always the best in a Walmart not that it's unsafe by any means, it probably isn't. It's probably very safe. But it's, it's, it will not, they don't always necessarily dissolve. The more expensive brands are tested for disintegration rates, right? So you say, well, the FDA said there must be vitamin C in everything on the shelf here that's stated on the label and say that's probably true. But it may not disintegrate. You know, it's basically, it should by law disintegrate in 45 minutes where ours will disintegrate, you know, inside 20. A, a two-piece capsule has to dissolve in in 20 minutes. Ours will dissolve in 10. These are all kind of pharmaceutical grade enhancements. I am a pharmacist. I understand manufacturers. We inspect all of our contract manufacturers to make sure uh, they are FDA and OTC approved. And those are those are very uh, powerful uh, delineations between somebody just starting up a fulfillment uh, or a contract manufacturer for. A, a vitamin company. There's a lot of them out there. It doesn't take much money to get into it, but to ha be able to pass these rigorous FDA and OTC inspections are the are what we use in our manufacturers are required. I visit at the mall and I audit them every year. Let's talk about um, why the ID Nutrition Solution is so powerful and truly fills in the nutritional gaps like no other solution in the world and and. I know you're passionate about this, and I am too, because of, of what that means for everyone's long-term health. Well, the gaps, you know, and everybody has them, and they're all different. You know, we've, we've have, uh, counseled uh, over 10,000 patients, and we find that 
rarely anybody over 45 would get two 45 year olds or anybody over 45 would get anything the same. So everybody has different gaps. It's all about even if you're a, a fitness instructor or you go to a trainer, you're going to get your fitness regimen will be personalized, right? Because it's just for you. So we use, uh, we, we like to say 100 people over 45, you'll get 100 different in, uh, uh, formulas, 100 different programs. We talked about the science, you know, where we're using all the 4,000 clinical studies. The quality we talk about with the, with the selection of the, of the nutrients, the, the uh, safety, again, with the drug nutrient interaction, screening those out, stopping it. If there's a particular nutrient that interacts with your drug, you won't get it. Not in our system. So we have the, we've built a system from the ground up. I mentioned that in the beginning. We started with the science, then the, we built the assessment and then the recommendation results, and then the nutritional program on top of it. So only at the end are we supplying, we believe, the finest uh, nutritional program because it's built with the correct building blocks, and those building blocks are the science and the formulations and the ingredients and then all the other details I've told you about. The chronobiology, giving the right nutrient at the right time of day, the right filler or a bioactive filler. So all of these features make, and most of them are different from anything on the market. 